Hello everyone and welcome back to Resident Evil Uno the first. What was I doing? Oh yeah, the shaft. Do I have that? Yep. We made it to this tunnel area. Uh we killed a big spider with a flamethrower. And now we're uh going towards an elevator. Isn't there a hunter in here? Or did I kill- I might have killed it. Hunter! Hello? Nope, it's dead. So, this stream, I'm probably gonna finish this game. Don't know exactly how much longer. I know... Oh, it's frozen. Uh, I know there's like... This area, then, like, one more area. Come on. Well, I have no idea how long the areas take. A series of flashing buttons. Press one. One. Two. Three. Four. Nothing happened. Oh, wait, I see. I see. Do I have to, like... Yes. Keep turning. Almost there. One more? Four, two, three, one. Here's the buttons. Four, two, three, one. The power's been restored. It's weird that they have the green lights even though you get it wrong. You're gonna be like, hey, you got it wrong. Red light. Take me down. Where am I now? Oh, item box. Wait, there's an item box but no save? Is there a boss fight? Hmm. Just in case. Why else would you give me the item box? Thing around this way. Nope. Any frightening monsters in here? I heard you. Where you at? Oh, wait, no. Oh, wait, you're invincible? Or you can't be hurt? Uh, I think. The monster with the chains? Do I need another flamethrower? Oh, boy. What are you? You look like a rejected horror movie killer. Where was this thing before I found it, like, at that abandoned shack? How the hell did get all the way in the tunnels? Box. Device for transferring materials. Do I have to transfer this box?
All right, good luck, box. I don't know why I did that. Uh, is there anything else here? Still red. Bucket? No. Chemicals. Why are you red? What's here? Is there nothing here? Oh. Where am I going? Sweet. Secret stash. Don't really want the handgun ammo. Save your space. This thing is invincible, right? Am I being stupid about that? Oh, there you are. I don't know what I did with that box. Where'd it go? Did it go like in all the way in the other room? Switch. Yes. Did that open one of the doors? What? Hey, do you know what I have to do with that dude? Is it? Which door is it? In this door already have that out? Yeah. I don't have a flamethrower. Oh god. Do you have anything special? I probably gotta come back. Maybe there is something in the box. Now, how do I get to the box? Uh, let me put this away. Actually, I should get a full mag. Try going down here. Now oh, there's the box. Now what do I do with you? I have to crush it? Get in the compactor. Goodbye, box. Can I lure that other monster over here? I don't think it could survive that. Flamethrower! I guess I could try using the flamethrower on it. Ah, uh, it's broken. Is there anything else in this room? What is still down here?
Waste materials. That was stuff getting harder and harder to find in this game. That's oh, kind of bucks. Yeah, whatever. I'm probably missing like one herb or more handgun bullets. Maybe a shotgun shell, who knows? There you are. Can I sneak past you? Who even were you once upon a time? Were you someone like important? Are you like a Mr. X kind of thing? There you are. Broken flamethrower. Goodbye, demon. I don't know if it is invulnerable. I just remember reading that no, like, the monster with chains. No matter how many bolts you put into it. What the fuck? The desk is cluttered with old beat-up dolls and used candles. Nice. Fire shows signs of use. Who is down here? But they said like, uh, it seems like that monster is, can't take damage. I like a book. What is that? Who bent these bars? Oh, snakes! Someone's bedroom? Bed is still warm. They just farted in it recently. <laughs> Avocados. Bunch of photographs featuring a young girl depicting various scenes from her upbringing. Be cool if I can see them. Was there another path that way? No. There's a box. Can I just open this, or do I need something? Oh. Stone ring. The only picture in notes. Something written on the back. November 10th, 1967. Progenitor virus administered Jessica. Administered virus type A. Plasmolizing the tish of tissue during cell activation. Virus fusion negative. Action disposed. Lisa, administered virus type B. Plasmolize, plasmolizing, plasmolizing of tissue during cell activation. Virus fusion positive but delayed fusion. Body modification observed constant results. Status continued protective observation. George, action terminated. That date, there's a journal left by someone. November 14th, 1967. I feel dizzy after that shot they gave me. I don't see mom. Where did they take her? My dog's like snoring. Uh, she promised that we should escape together. Did she escape alone and leave me behind? November 15th. I found mom. We ate together. I felt happy. But she was a fake. Not my real mom. Same face, but different inside. I have to find mom, have to give face back to mother. I got mom's face back. Nobody can on my mom except me. I attach her face to me so she doesn't go away. Because mom's sad when I meet her without her face. November 17th, 1907. From inside box, scent of mommy. Maybe true mother there. Stone box hard. It hurt, seal rope in the way. Can't see mother because four stones. So it, it did this guy become that big monster? The 
face looks kind of weird. Looks like a leather face, th leather face thing going on, where you attach someone's other face to him. Green herb, blue herb. Uh, I don't want the open space. Where am I going now? Ah, oh, back at this place. I guess that makes sense how that thing got there. Uh, can I inspect this? Do I have to do anything with it right now? Do I have to combine it with something? I have a lot of key items. Metal objects? Hey! Stone and metal object. Oh wait, did I... So I... Okay, I think I get it now. I'll do a save. Um, there is that one object back in the mansion. That... Kind of looks like this symbol. I think I have to pick it up, use both on the bottom door to finally open it. A family picture. Journal left. 19. Daddy attached first, mom attached second. Inside Reddit's library, waiting hard. Not true, mom, where? Don't know dad, found mom again. Why ain't attached mommy? She moved no more. She's screaming. Why? Just to want to be with her. Four. Mom. Where? Hey. Miss. You all. That guy's crazy. Come on, save. There you go. Uh, do you think I need the Magnum? Just in case. And that's the item that was missing from here. Never, never been in that area on the left. That's probably where I'm going next. Well, I gotta go back to the mansion. So... Get the item in the red room, then open that door. I think. Has that fire always been going there? So that's a long fire, that thing knows how to make a fire. Okay. Oh, I remember I got lost. It's not like going in circles last time I was here. Oh, you're a crimson head. Just run. Just keep running. Just keep running. Uh, we run. Always oh, fast. Oh. Made it. Okay, I'm going the right way. I know that was a crimson or what? Wasn't risking it. Where am 
Where am I now? Back at that little shack. Yep. Any more items, Wesker? Did you come back through here again? No? Okay. This. Yep, they look identical. Now, it's all blue. <laughs> Beautiful. Everything in the mansion. Fuck everything else. Alright, um... Is there still a hunter in here? Probably. She gotta go through this room, through the crow room, outside, back in and down. Yep. Birds, it's probably gonna be the last time I see ya. Have a good life. Thank you for not attacking me. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. At least it better be. There's one. No. Cut. No. Finally, I go into the basement. Now, this is probably the last time I'm gonna be at the mansion. You probably want me to save, don't you? I should have brought a ribbon. Oh. Where am I right now, does it say? Altar. I think I have one more save. Uh, it's a lot of lost progress if I die. Just running back here. Ah, eh, screw it. Thirty saves. Jesus. How is there that many ribbons in this game? Is this place an altar? Why is there an altar underneath the mansion? You're a bit of a mess up, Chris. Hey, a piece of the action. Wesker. Oh. Uh, you got it, Wesker. It's all you. I believe in you, man. Whoop. Can I just leave? Are we gonna push all these in? Keep it busy, Wesker. Uh, 
Wait, oh, did he just die? What the fuck? Sorry, Wesker. Oh yeah, you did write the note. Wesker, are you good? An end to a poor girl's misery. Oh, that was a girl. Defeat Lisa Trevor using Chris. Uh, so is Wesker gone? Maybe he wasn't the imposter? I don't know. Where the fuck am I now? Have I been here? Oh, I'm in the area. Large iron door won't budge. Uh... Anything over here? Is there an item box anywhere here? Can I go back to one? Uh... Oh yeah, I think so. Um... So wait. There's the wolf and eagle. Is there a third one? Oh, no, it's just those two. Okay. Well, I got both of them. I'll be back. I even looked to see if Wesker is possibly still alive down there. Could you have saved him or was he always going to fall? Uh, there's no random box. Like, there is something in this room. What is it? What am I missing? Is there anything? Oh, there's the box. Okay, I, I guess that was definitely a boss fight, so I'm just going to put that away for now. Sorry, I have space. Uh, eagle metal. Where's the wolf? Still got the ammo disc. Don't know what I need it for. Nah. I really want to take another gun, but only six fucking spots, really? I look inside here. Can I take something? Inside the skeleton. Wait, there's something else. It's a letter. 
to my Lisa. Day by day, I can feel my consciousness drifting further away. The shots given to me by the men in white clothes made some of mommy's itching go away. Today, they gave me another shot saying it was nutrition. When they gave me the shot, mommy's... When they gave me the shots, mommies can't think straight, but mommy's shocked and sad because mommy's unable to think of you all the time. Mommy's afraid, afraid of getting everything, especially the memories of you and daddy. What your faces look like, how you put together, they're all starting to disappear into somewhere dark in my mind. Oh, Lisa, I wish I could touch your face and hold you in my arms right now, so that I can hold on to our wonderful memories of you and daddy. Lisa, we can't stay here any longer. We have to escape. Listen to me, Lisa. Our chances to escape in the is the next time we go to the lab together. We'll both pretend that we are both unconscious and that the man in white clothes is off guard. That'll be our chance. When we're on the outside, let's look for daddy together. Okay, sweetie. Be strong, Lisa. I'm trying to remember. Who was the father? Was it George Trevor? He died in the mansion. Yeah, because he kept writing like, my dear Lisa. So they came looking for him, I guess? Or did whoever was here kidnap them? Is this all Umbrella? Do, do they own this mansion? Okay, this is Wolf. Eagle. Hell is that? Another elevator? I thought I was going through the door. Maybe the door is coming back. The sign reads, will not open unless first class emergency. I don't know if it's a first class. I didn't get a pamphlet. Oh, sweet. Might as well. New area. I have no idea how people go through this game with only like one save. That's kind of like the most frightening thing to do because at any point you could die and have to restart hours of progress. It probably is an achievement though. Early three saves maybe. Probably play on easy mode, but easy mode on this is like fucking hard on today's things. I'm gonna guess this is the lab. What's up, man? So is that the technique to blow their heads off? Look at all these green herbs. You see all this shit, man? You didn't blow off. Take all these, combine them. How did I get hurt? That was from, uh... The daughter, Lisa? Alright, I got a mega weed. Another CD. And to go through this door. Or not. Am 
I gonna need to put these discs in like a computer? This is a laboratory, so just make the most sense for there to be one here. At least we came back just to zombies. Not hunters or snakes or anything, just normal zombies. I do have to find some ammo soon. Is there another one here? No. Oh, where'd you come from? Well, at least it's gonna be a one shot. Waste of a shell. Shells, 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 shells. First aid kit. I'm good on heals. I need ammo. Now if you can just release the locks for the levers. So many doors down here. An X-ray of Clark David. Oh, do I have to like organize all these? June eighth, nineteen ninety-eight. My dearest Ada, Ada Wong. By the time you read this letter, I will no longer be the person you once knew. The results of my test came out today, and as I suspected, it came out positive. I feel like I am teetering on the edge of the reason, just thinking about my independent doom. I would give anything not to have become one of them. As far as I know, you were not infected. I sincerely hope things do not reach such a desperate pass. But if it has turned out the way... But if it has turned out that you are now the last person remaining alive, I want you to get the material from the visual data room. Then activate the self-destruct system in the power room and escape from here. Please do everything in your power to make this whole accident public. If everything is still running normally, you should be able to release all the locks using the security system. I have set up the terminal in the small security room so that you can log into your system using my name and your name as password. You'll need another password to release the lock of the base of the door in the basement, level 2, where the visual data room is located. As a safety measure, I have coded that password into an x-ray picture. Uh... Rio Ro and G Ro Ro and Genogram. Maybe. I know you, and I'm sure you'll be able to work it out without any trouble. There is just one more thing. It is my last quest. I hope you never have to lay your eyes on me in this state, but if you do happen to run into me in my hideous form, I beg you to put me out of my misery. Hope you understand. Thank you, Ada. Yours truly, John. John Ada. Okay. Gail Holland. I remember when the message board catches your attention. Something scrawled on the notepad. To use the electronic door, please paste the initials in alphabetical order. So... Let me open this. Just gonna use that. Alex Beckett, Ed Fisher, what was this one? Clark. 
So Clark has to go here, here in Gale on the end. Which one was which? Excuse me? Come on. You have to be so precise with this shit. Did I do it right? I mean, I can't move these two, so it's literally 50-50. Literally Should I just try flipping them one more time? Uh, I mean, it's alphabetical, right? Even if it was the last name, it's still... What was it? Beckett? Beshit? David? Or Clark, yeah, Clark David Fisher, then Holland. Still alphabetical. Don't know what I have to use the password for. Any, uh, shells? Anywhere, please. Ooh, magnum ammo. Uh, any shotgun? Uh, is this the John David one? Or John Ada? Nailed it. Do I need the first name or the last name? About three. Okay. the password for this one can I just exit V act researchers note there is no evidence that when the host loses consciousness the body goes into a dormant state during this time, the virus becomes active and rapidly transforms and reconstructs the basic composition of the body. Host eventually mutated into a humanoid creature. We call them VX. Call them zombies. Its speed and amazing muscular development are particularly noteworthy. After transformation, it becomes more agile and aggressive. Must be a different zombie. Already four of our researchers have died from trying to feed it, turning the place into an instant bloodbath. Ever since this tragic and barbaric accident, we have decided to call its kind Crimson Heads. That's it. That dangerous and precious prototype specimen can't be left there. We have to figure out the way to deal with it. Termination is definitely not an option. We finally decided to freeze the specimen and confine the body inside the basement of the backyard cemetery. Have I been there? Alright, where's that note?
I'm thinking about all the initials. It's literally A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. Would that be it? No. No. Let's just try. Alex, Beckett, Clark, David, Ed, Fisher, George, Holland. Let me go back in that room. Is one of these a crimson head? I'll tell you that. The cadavers are frozen, wrapped in body bags. Uh, where's that magnum arrow? Is there an item box right here? Still missing something. Maybe something with a computer. Nothing shiny. Anything I can pick up? Who knows? How do you even get to the lower floors? All these other doors are locked, right? There's two more in here. Yep. I need to turn the power on or something. Uh, where's the item box? Is that up here? What's with the music? Why are you doing this? Am I gonna need to burn some bodies? Why do you have the kerosene here? Okay. Uh, you can go away. I guess you can go away for now. Don't need you either. I'll take the pistol with all the ammo. Because I got plenty. Oh, it's my face. I thought I saw someone behind the door. Okay, so I need um, to figure out that password. What did I even unlock? 
Basement two. I'm gonna guess that opens this door. What the fuck did I open with basement three? It's this floor, right? Uh, what's in here? Yeah. Oh, maybe I open that door on the right. Yep, that was locked before. <gasps> of course I just put the stuff away in the box. Slide filter. Gotcha. <laughs> I got plenty to spare, asshole. Are you John by any chance? Okay, you're dead. Uh, what is this? Facts. To Sanitation Division, Attention Manager of Sanitation from Raccoon Disaster Contingency Committee. The contents, contents of this fax are confidential and intended for the named addressee only. Any copying or disclosure of the contents of this fax to any third party is strictly forbidden by the sender. Sorry, we can't read it. How do I exit out? After reading the contents of this fax, it must be destroyed immediately. We expect significant increase in the damage done by the recent T virus outbreak that initially estimated there are several concerns. First concern, more than half of the re researchers have been infected by the T-Virus and died. It has also been reported that almost all the survivors in the, of this accident are starting to show symptoms of the T-Virus infection. Secondly, our secret, secret security protocol team, SSPT, has also been completely eradicated. Therefore, our most secret research is in danger of public disclosure. Quick actions are demanded to prevent mass media coverage. Third concern, there is a high possibility that most of the specimens are running loose inside the compound. We expect many casualties to follow. However, yet unfortunate, these casualties underscore the, su the success of our research results. Actions must be taken to prevent our research results from being made public. We suspect the first official intervention will come from the state police and STARS. We strongly, su strongly recommend taking measures against them first. Didn't do a good job. We're still here. A security system passcode transmission device. If you had an MO disk, you could turn it up. Oh. Now I need the disk. Set the virus. Fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. Someone won't take it. Uh, can I do anything with this? There are red colored slides inside, nothing on it. Can I take one out? Can I look through all of them? Is there even a projector anywhere? Uh... I'll take these. Let me look in here one more time, see if I can decipher this puzzle. Maybe they're literally in the wrong spot. Something with a light? Okay, parts of them are glowing red. But that doesn't make any sense though.
or alphabetic alphabetical name or alphabetical by their what's wrong with them the colon esophagus liver what was the other one esophagus liver lung What do you want from me? I get that they're glowing red, but I don't understand what that means. Place the initials in alphabetical order. Okay. I can't remember what that note says. Do you mean into a or n x-ray picture so it's just one of them thank god in this play this game in the 90s firstly because i was a baby but also because i would be so confused i would just give up Fuck it, I'm looking it up. You're not making it easy. Oh, shit. Really, they turn that fast? <sighs> yeah, because they explain that so fucking well. So the password is uh, colon, esophagus, liver, lung. Because that's the order it's in. Oh, you don't grab me? There we go. Hasta la vista. Yeah, I'm still fine. I got four of those things. At what point do they say you need the the first initial or first letter from each disease? How are you supposed to figure that out? Do I look like a mathematician to you? John 
Ada. Sell. Because that was so easy to see. No, oh, it shows me what door unlocks. Okay. Don't need this room anymore. Uh, there's still something in here, huh? Are any of you anything? No, like shotgun shells secretly hidden about. I keep finding magnum ammo, but not a single shotgun shell. Really? Maybe I should swap the shotgun to magnum. Um, there's still something even in this hall. Oh yeah, you definitely see that, right? Why are these things so hidden? Okay. Um, might as well get those ink ribbons. How do I unlock that door? I have to somehow unlock the levers. That's everything. See ya. Someone came alive. Or real life. Again. Do I even have space? And let's see. What's the worst that can happen? First aid, is that a note? Another disc. Oh yeah, there's a... Shit, where can I have used a disc? Oh, projector. Shells. Thank you. Only six? Fuck you. Alright, so I got first aid in here, another disc. Where was that room with the other disc? Was it? Was it possibly where that crimson head is now? It might be. I'm gra I'm grabbing the magnum. It better one shot these fucking things. Also, just grab that disc from the other room and do a save. Save. Magnum. Uh, 
Yeah, a lot of ammo. Jeez. Oh my god. Oh my god, really? Oh girl, if I need to use more than six shots, that's an absolute waste. Gonna need that. I'm gonna put my healing thing back in here so I can grab the other one. Brave man, I don't have any gun equipped. Take that, take the disc. Play the films. Umbrella, Bioorganic Weapon Official Report. MA-39 Cerberus. FIO-3, Neptune. I killed both of them. MA-121, Hunter. Killed you. TO-2, a tyrant. I haven't fought you yet. Bioorganic Weapons Research Group Development Staff. 8462. Is that a password for something? 8462. Still something in her. Can I go into this room? How do I get in there? See, there's like a narrow path. Oh, security protocols. Level one, hello port for executive use only. This restriction does not apply in the event of an emergency. Basement level one, passage to hello port entry is prohibited unless accompanied by a consultant researcher or the chief of security. Unauthorized persons entering the hello port will be shot on sight. Elevator, the elevator stops during emergencies. Basement level 2, visual data room for use by the Special Research Division only. All other access to the visual data room must be cleared with Kevin Arving, room manager. Level 3, prison sanitation division controls the use of the prison. At least one consultant researcher, E. Smith, S. Ross, A. Wesker. Is that my Wesker? I don't know his first name. Must be present if viral use is authorized. Triple locked door entry into the room is limited to the sole person who deactivates the lock with all of the passcodes. Accessing the executive output terminal located in each section of the senior researchers deactivates the lock. Power room. This room is nitro compound. This in this room, nitro compound is used as a primary fuel source of power. Access is limited to headquarters supervisors. This restriction may not apply to consultant researchers with special authorization. Basket output terminals. Use and access of the output terminals is limited to authorized senior researchers. There's a level four. Regarding the progress of Tyrant after the administration of T-Virus, Legible hereafter. Is the tyrant on level four? Is he in this game? I really thought he was only in two. Does this take place before or after two? Oh, uh. Was it 
different order. A four six two. Nailed it. There it is. Laboratory key. Oh, okay. Image editing equipment. Looks like you can use it to view Kenneth's film. Oh my. I've had this tape since the beginning. <laughs> Kenneth was the dude I met in the hallway, the first zombie I met. Come on, Kenneth. Well, I'm glad I saw that. <laughs> I've had that for so goddamn long. There's still some... How is there still something in this room? Where is this? Well, that's everything. Oh, um... How do I open these doors? Well, that one might be open now. Or the one I on the left. Alright, let me take this disc down. Where was that room? It might have a crimson head in it. You're still dead. Might be in the right room. There also was that thing of, uh, actually might be in this room too. That like, uh, container inside that glass wall thing. He dead? You kidding me? Magnum shot? Two magnums for a crimson head? How strong are these guys? Yeah, that thing. There it is. Oh, do I have to find more of these? Wait, are those in every area? I mean, I have more discs, but... Did I even find any more of those? the disc out of my inventory? Yeah. Uh, and I guess I can go back and uh... Alright, was there a thing in this room? Find more of those computer things, I guess. Maybe that opened... Oh, wait. Ah, oh, damn it. I thought maybe it would have opened one of the other doors. Was there one in... 
the cold room? Oh, you are a crimson head. Did it bleed out? Okay. Thought his foot looked a little red. Uh, still locked. Oh. Yes. Should I go grab disc? Yeah, let's see what's in here first. Spider? What am I hearing? More shells. What the fuck is this thing? It's a human animal hybrid. <laughs> Fuck, that was like a human cockroach. Oh, Jesus. Did they really have all this shit back in the day? What the hell were they thinking? How have I not heard about these animals or these weird creatures? There's another vent going that way. Or is there anything in this room? What was the point of this room? Just to go through vents? Still something in here though. Can I even go over to the left? Uh, maybe the other vent in the other room? I'm on this side now because that makes sense. I will take. Need a disc. Oh, that makes things easier. Bunch of bodies. Hello. Might as well go grab two of the discs. Because I assume the other one's going to be somewhere in that... Uh... That area. Man, I really thought even the first Resident Evil game was just going to be zombies. I was so wrong. I thought it was just going to be, you know, zombies, maybe a mutated boss fight of like a tyrant or something. There were so many animals, so many mutated monsters. I did not expect any of this. Hunters, whatever those fucking beetles were. When's the last time I saved? I have four. Might as well. Get everything I need first. Where's my magnum ammo?
Maybe I should just carry the Magnum? <laughs> no. There's gotta be like a big boss fight at the end. I'm gonna save it for that. Here we go. This is the weirdest save list ever. It goes like 31, 32, 27. Then at the end, it's 34. Then there's like a free space. Okay, give me both discs. Actually, uh... I got so many heals. I saw that self-defense gun. I don't know what... It's one bullet. What does it do? Is it useful for anything? He's like a one-shot instant kill kind of gun. What if you can use it on a boss and like it's a one-shot? That'd be cool. This way. This can here go in the other place. Find where that disc goes. I can uh, open the other door. Oh, what? <laughs> you come on. Why did that stay? <laughs> what the fuck? I gonna stay uh, on the other side. There's two. And now this big area to my right. God, that's huge. Oh wait, was I in there? Yeah. Uh, big door. Our elevator. Operate the switch on the right hand side. No power. Oh, another save room. Wait, there's a typewriter. Is there a uh, chest? Yep. Okay, let's gear up and get out. That away. Put this away for right now, so I can grab the other things. Uh, is that Magnum? See that ribbon? Can I can I grab it? Give me a ribbon. Oh. Okay. Still got six ribbons. Jesus. <laughs> Twenty-four magnum rounds. Oh my god. Was the magnum this? Like. Typically, you think of a Magnum and Resident Evil, it's like the ultimate weapon. I probably could have done another save right there, but 
It just takes too long. No, oh, I thought there was another bug. I hear you. Where are you at? Oh, jeez, what the fuck? You're a tough little bastard, ain't you? Took so many bullets. Fuck it, pulling this out. Damn, what were you little fucks? Oh, I think that was it. Fading away? Sounds like there's another one. Fuel may explode if shaken or jarred. A refueling device for the power room. Not working right now because there's no fuel. There's an empty capsule. Yeah, okay. Shake, shake, shake. Oh, that was the only thing in here. Is there a door right here? No. There's another bug. I'm just gonna run to the door. <laughs> Save my bullet for something more useful. Like this bug. Or whatever's in here. Hey, the disc. Alright, that's all three. Is there really another bug in here? No, it's disappearing. Okay. There's another one. And another one. Did you go on the ceiling? Get down from there. Oh my- okay, fuck it. Is there anything else in this room? There is. Whatever. Why are there so many bugs? <laughs> Can I, like, load this fuel capsule or something? Where do I use the fuel? Oh, computer, computer. Oh, this is a self-destruct mechanism. I'm gonna blow all you spiders up. <laughs> so do I have to go all the way back to the, uh... Lever room? Or door with all the lever switches? Oh, come on, I thought I killed all of you in here. Maybe they just keep following me from room to room. See, you gave me in here, assholes. Okay, we... Re-gear. Re um... Refuel the Magnum. Refuel and reload. <laughs> I 
probably going to be using that soon. Let me save. Because why not? What is this, 34? Yep. Put you back in your place, and time to go. And all these should be green to go. It's about time. Okay, what uh, danger is waiting for me in here? Jill? Chris? Jill. Where have you been this entire time Wesker's in here? The... I know. Oh, so I guess Wesker is the imposter. Well, is he dead? He kind of fell. I can't open it. Just wait, I'll be back. Okay. Wait, where do I use the fuel? Uh, do I get fuel from that one room? In here? Is that fuel? Whatever is behind the glass container? Oh, it is a refueling device. I thought it was like a fire sample. Okay, fuel supply capsule. The main ingredient of this fuel appears to be nitro compound. Running could result in a fatal explosion. So I guess we're walking. All the way to... Self-destruct device, huh? I really want to run. <laughs> I really want to see what happens. So you could have not even found Jill without a... Like before you fueled this thing up. Take your time, Chris. <laughs> Although we did say running could prove fatal. Oh, how am I going to do this with the bugs? I'm just going to have to walk past them all. I don't want to keep shooting because I feel like they might just keep respawning. Okay, through here. Left down. Okay. And the refueling's on the other side in the last room. Oh, 
Through the door. What if they hit me? <laughs> what was the warning? Is that like if you jostle? Okay, down and around. I might just have to take damage. These bugs are fucking morons. Now just get to the other side. Ow. Ow. You put it in, you can kill all the bugs you want. How did I only get hit once? Where do you feel it? Excuse me, bug. Where do you feel this? Oh, wait. You have to go back to where you got it from, probably. I went the wrong way. Oh, 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 oh. Let me go. All right, fuck you. Ew. Still alive? I can take it like one more hit. Why did I come? <laughs> I just made it harder for myself. I'm supposed to get it where I picked it up. Maybe they're all dead. Or not. I guess they just keep coming. Nice try, bitch. Come on, come on, come on. Let me put it in. Yes. Yeah, there we go. Little bastard. Okay, let me uh heal up and reload. Back in that safe room. Then I'll go turn on the self-destruct. I'm just gonna carry that magnum now. Shotgun, two bullets, I don't care. Give me more and more magnum ammo, so that's what I'm gonna use. About four bullets. First aid. Magnum ammo. 20 rounds. Should I take the pistol? I have a lot of pistol ammo. If like someone's on the ground, I'll make sure they're dead with it. Okay, so now just go turn it on. There's still something in that room. Boo. Oh, did I finally kill all the bugs? What did I miss in here? I 
Oh, there it is. Hang on. Flash grenade, sweet. Cool bastard. Oh. I wish I could just throw the flash grenade. It's nice I get to like put it in their mouth and it's like an instant blow up, but still. Started it. Um, is she gonna blow? Oh, this is for the main elevator. I thought I was gonna have to start this self-destruct sequence. There's a minute elevator at the end of this hall. Yeah, might as well save again. It's on the way, and um, I got plenty. I guess the bugs do have a limited amount. Also, I got hurt a little bit. Or maybe I didn't? I don't know. I got plenty of heals. Save 35. <laughs> Let's go for that one. This is just awful to look at. 34, 32, 27, 28, 35, 30, 33. No data. Hopefully it's a good idea to start using the Magnum now. Hopefully like it, I don't really like need it that much as I think I do. Press button. Chris! Rebecca, Rebecca, you're still here? I saw you in the inner garden. You just caught up to me? I finally caught up. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Do I have to save you again? No more following. Just stay with me, kid. Please, we That's should have done that from the beginning. Do I finally have an ally? <laughs> why do- why did we split up at all? Oh my god, she's with me. So if I didn't save her, would she not be here with me? Oh, she's actually following. Where am I? Oh, before. There's something in here, Rebecca. Do you see what? Rebecca, what is it? What is there? S sniff it out. Do you smell it? She's like, uh, Chris? You okay, man? Aha. I don't have the shotgun. It's really gearing me up. I'm just gonna go grab that shoddy back. <laughs> Swap it out with the pistol. I'll be right back, Rebecca. Away. Where did I put that shoddy? Oh, 
This way. What if I just saved again for the fuck of it? Fuck of it? The hell of it. Hey, Rebecca, let's go. Biohazard, uh oh. That's a futuristic door. Wesker. But you're alive. So you've come. Chris, you make me proud. But of course Welcome, you Daddy. Are one of my men. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Since when, Wesker? I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. I Since found when have they been slipping you a paycheck? I think you're a bit confused. I've always been with Umbrella. Dun dun dun. Stars were umbrellas. No, rather, my little piggies. The tyrant virus leaked, polluting this whole place, and unfortunately, I had to give up my lovely members of Stars. You killed them with your own dirty hands. You son of a bitch! No. Oh yes, dear. Just like this. Becca! Don't move. You. I saved I her for nothing. I just yet. I have something that's of some interest to you. Oh, is that the tyrant? Uh. Uh oh. Are we gonna fight? Jill's still locked in the basement. <laughs> oh, this is like end of RE2, Tyrant. The ultimate life form, Tyrant. <laughs> Wesker, you've become senile. Chris, you'll never understand. It's magnificent. Well, I you stars members dying, aren't they? Hey, man. High five? On, you test tube freak. Fuck that. <laughs> Rebecca, I'll save you. I'm perfect type for his dick. I can suck him. Ow, ow, ow. Oh. Aha. Didn't see that coming, did you? Okay. Okay. Uh. Reload. Is that top? Is that high enough? Yes, yeah, suck it. Did I actually kill him? Oh my god. So, Wesker. What a pathetic way to die. <laughs> He's holding something. Observation note. The discovery of the G virus was in fact 21 years after the administration of the primogenitor virus. The prototype parasite which we had delivered from a laboratory in France was administered to the sample of to the sample specimen. The sample specimen took in the parasite without showing any signs of adverse reaction. The lack of any reaction was an unsolved mystery, and now everything is clear to me. The prototype parasite was incubating in the sample specimen body for 21 years. Then, f from that incubating state, the prototype suddenly mutated. Evolved may be more of an appropriate way to or describe it. This observation gave me more insight in my research. Through further mod modification and testing, I was able to deprive, derive a method to create the G that surpasses the performance of the T. 
This was the breakout. This was the breakthrough that would change the future of BOW's history. I can't wait to see the look on Alexa's annoying face when I finally announce my research. But unfortunately, I'll have to wait a few more a few more years to completely verify my findings of William Birkin. The dude from RE2, huh? So, uh, nothing else in here? Is there anything over here? What electronic lock? Oh, was I locked in here? I didn't even realize. <sighs> Poor Rebecca, she got the... She got... Just... What a poor... Oh, is she alive? <laughs> Rebecca! Chris... It's a good thing you were wearing your bulletproof vest. Why didn't you shoot you in the head? To do here. Let's get moving. Okay. Well, good thing I got you. I could have probably left her. Okay. Uh, I guess we go save Jill? Do I save her? I mean, I don't have a key or anything. It's still locked, right? Well, Rebecca, you did absolutely nothing. <laughs> Oh, cutscene. I found a file in the lab. Apparently, there's still a lot of tyrant virus here. We should blow this whole place up. Right. The show must go on. I'll leave that up to you, Rebecca. I'm on it. I'll start the self-destruct system I found a little while ago. It's not like we're out of this yet. I'll see you on the outside. Outside. What about Jill? Can I just go get her? Maybe I opened the lock from uh, the other room. All right. Um. I'm. Just, I mean, if we're about to blow this place up, there might be one more boss fight. I'll use the magnum for that. Let me save it. Where are my ribbons? you back equipped you time to go rescue Jill so when she left with Wesker did he immediately like throw her in here because he betrayed uh how do I through here through this triple lock room no That was fast, Rebecca. Oh, all locks, huh? I'm coming, Jill. I'm just gonna run. Oh my god. Why is the game like slowly pausing every camera angle? Why is it doing that? Is it because the lights are on now? Jill, it's time to get out of here. Self-destruct 
Jill, sorry I made you wait. I knew you'd come. Do you not hear the alarm? Do you not hear the doors are open? You can run. Why was she just sitting in there? It's about to blow up. I guess I'll wait. All right, Chris and Jill back together. Sorry, I made you wait. Save Jill from confinement using Chris. Could you have not? Could you have not gone for her? Let's get going. Right behind you. Uh, Jill, go immediately through the door. There are monsters outside. What if Jill hasn't seen a single zombie this entire time? <laughs> what if she's just like, what the fuck is that thing? <laughs> like she doesn't even know what's going on. I barely use that, uh, fuel. After I found it was only like a limited use, I was like, yeah, fuck this. Where does this take me? Oh, hey, Joe. There's no need to go back. Wait, where am I going? Oh. Oh yeah, this was locked. Did I even realize there was a door here? Why are you fueling me up? A single herb. I'll use it now. I mean, I don't have the shotgun, so shells are kind of useless. I'll take them anyway. If I need space, I can use one of the eels. Brad, you're still alive? Talk to him, you fucking moron. Give me a sign you're alive. <laughs> no response. Okay, we're gonna get the power back. Where's the fuse? What? Joe, you see a fuse anywhere? Uh... Where's the fuse? Is there one back here? It's right there. Time to use a heal. Yummy, yummy in my tummy. It's a good thing there's not like a real timer for this. And alright too, it's like, you have 10 minutes, you better get out. Is that a fuse? It looks like a chemical weapon. Hey, Rebecca. Systems activated. I can work. tell. Brad's up in the helicopter. Those things are coming. I'll take care of them. But Chris, you just get in contact with Brad somehow. Okay. 
Uh, Rebecca, she said she'll handle it. Girl power. Okay, Bradley. Oh, now there's a timer. No music. Where is the helipad? Whoa, what's this? S signal rockets. Do I have to open this? Okay, how do I... use them? Can I just use? Tyrant? You're still alive, huh? Jill's dead. Rebecca's really gonna die this time. Hey! Fat ass! Oh, Jesus Christ! So, is this like a real fight or do we have to hold out for three minutes? Random buddy. You can all reload? I never knew that. Run. Run. Oh. Come on, this way. Oh, uh oh. Rebecca. Rebecca. Do something, Rebecca. He's got me. Flash grenade. But then I got like six of those. Uh, how hurt am I? Yeah, caution. It'd be great if I could see him. Chris, use it. Kill it, whatever it is. Where is it? Where is it? Wait for me, tyrant. Ooh. Goodbye. Do you really need the pooch, pooch? Brad, did you throw that? Because I did not hear the helicopter. The nightmare ends. Finish the game saving Rebecca and Jill using Chris. I didn't save that one guy. What was his name? Richard? Oh my god, we're actually done. So long, mansion. For this has to take place before one, because two and three take place close by to each other and Jill's in three. Like a couple weeks after, maybe. And that's Resident Evil for now. Should I do Jill's playthrough? There's no one here, so I'm just talking to myself. I know that she has more inventory space, but takes more damage or has less health. Oh, man. I'll probably do it. Now that I know what I'm doing, I could probably easily run through it all. I picked up a lot of shit along the way. Um, but regardless, I pretty much finished the game. So I am going to rank it. I just have to set this up really quick. Uh, give me a second.
Okay, that's good enough. Uh, so if you don't know... Wait, whoops. That's not it, that's not it. Wait. <laughs> that was for... Uh... RE2. Trust me, this game's not 10 out of 10. Yeah, so, uh, if you don't know, I like to rank games here, because... Because why not? Uh, I rank them on a 10-point scale with five categories of two points each. Those categories are design, gameplay, story, worth the money, and funness. Uh, first up, design. This game is was made in the 90s. It was remastered. Chris, you did a fine job. 10 hours. Uh, you can see this, right? Yeah. Wait time, 10 hours, 25 minutes. Creatures Dispatch, 124. Ammo used, 368. Ribbons used, 36. Health items used, 38. I bet you there are people that can get all this in zero. <laughs> Chris has a new costume. Oh, you can change costumes. Might as well. You do like New Game Plus? Once again. Not in the mood to die. Finish the game on easy difficulty or higher. What was that on normal? Ending Chris 1. How many... Oh my god. So I assume there's an ending if you don't save Jill, don't save Rebecca, don't save either or. Or like, only save Rebecca, only save Jill. There's a very easy difficulty. I might do that for Jill just so I can get through it. So if I press this, Resident Evil. okay, I get to choose. So this is like uh, story B. <laughs> nice outfit, Chris. Chill, chill. Okay, I'm not gonna do this now. Gonna do this another day. But um, back to the ranking. Ten point scale, five categories, two point cheats. Categories, design, cable, like, sorry, worth the money, funness. First up, design. The game came out a very long time ago. Look at it right now. Honestly, for the time, it looks really good. I, do, I know it looks very different from uh, the remastered. Like, you could probably count the pixels in the original original. I mean, this one still looks very good. The, uh... The map set out is great. The mansion, the courtyard, all the puzzle rooms, the puzzles. I liked it all. The sound design was good. The bullets, the zombie sounds. Monster designs. The hunters look cool. The tyrant, cool. The uh, weird human hybrid things fucking snake obviously it looks dated in its time but for the time it looks good you know what? i'm gonna give the design a two because why not now gameplay by one roll if you have any game with a camera that's fixed you lose a point i'm sorry but that's just the worst whoever made that decision should be fired from whatever they're doing right now it's just the worst thing ever it sucks, because you can't see around the corner. It's hard to walk around sometimes. At least they give you aiming. Like, we'll aim for you, just aim in the right direction. Somewhat. Um, all the puzzles were interesting and unique. Some of them were a bit harder than others. Some of them not. Uh, guns were, felt good. It's only, what was there, four guns? The pistol, shotgun, magnum, flamethrower for a bit. 
and rocket launcher. Uh, yeah, that was all fun. I could have had more inventory space. Only six slots? Are you kidding me? With a game where there's probably at least a hundred items, you have to run back so much or use it all at once. But I guess that is part of the challenge back in the day. Uh, gameplay, I'll give a one. If it wasn't for the fun gameplay, or the... If it wasn't for, like, the fun puzzles and stuff, I'd get a one. Or, it would get a zero. Story. So, I mean, as I see where it all started, stars get sent to a uh, mansion to get disposed of by Umbrella, who created the zombie virus. I guess Wesker was their leader, and he turned out to be uh, working for Umbrella, trying to kill them all. Didn't really explain everything. I might have missed some stuff, I don't know, but also... This voice acting. It's gotta be some of the worst I've heard. Especially from Chris, the main star of the game. <laughs> Was this voice actor drunk on that day, or was he high, or did he have five minutes? I don't know. Story, I'll give a one. It's nice to see where it all started, but could have explained better, and plus some of the acting. Ugh. Uh, worth the money. How much would it have been in 1998? <laughs> I don't even know how much... This cost. I bought it a long time ago. Let me look up if I can find the price. Uh, it's like twenty bucks right now. It's on sale for five dollars on PlayStation. Um, the original was actually selling for hundred fifty bucks. On some sites. I guess like the super rare one. Or like the first one that came out. Um, I'll say like it's around like the normal price for a triple A game. I think it's worth it. That was a 10 hour experience. Of like a blind playthrough. It's what you typically get from a uh, Resident Evil game. But you can go back your play, your play through Jill's story. Might be the same thing. You could try different endings. Yeah, I'll say it was worth the money. Do you get a two for that? Welcome. Funness? I mean... I did have a good time with it. I was frustrated a lot of the time by like stupid decisions that were being made. Or... Not really like in-game like, why are you making that decision your stupid character, but like... Why did they make this a thing? For example, this six item inventory space, really? You just want to keep going in this game. You don't want to have to run back to the item box every time just to put a uh, herb away. Um, I really did enjoy it, but there were a lot of things I could have made it better. You get a one. And is that it? I lost track of something. Hang on. Yep, that's everything. So, if you weren't keeping track, that means we have a 7 out of 10. Pretty good for the Resident Evil standards. I forget what the other ones got. Actually, I could look it up. Um, in case you were wondering, the RE2 remake. Got a 10 out of 10. Great game. Amazing game. 3 got an 8. The remake. And Village, a 9. So I went from 10, 9, 8, 7. I got H1. And also there is, um... The series ranking. Not really any question. Or actually, it might be a question. So these are the games I've played on this channel. Actually, all the games I've played at all. I'm really getting into this series with RE2. There, went from there. Um, 
Is it better than the 3 remake? I mean, the 3 remake was really fun. But it really felt like a cash grab for Mario 2. And also there were a lot of people who played the original complaining like there was a lot of stuff cut from it. I never played 3. First one. Um... Mm. Nah. This one's going at 4. Resident Evil. I'll fix this all later, but... Yeah, it's going at 4. RE3 is just a much more... fun, action-based game for me. I felt like this one really nails, like, all the puzzles and stuff RE's known for. 3 has that. I think this does it better, but also 3 is... It's obviously newer. So it's a lot more contemporary of a game, but also... a lot more action-y, which I like. Yeah, so the series rankings, number one, RE2 Remake 2, RE Village, and three, the RE3 Remake 4, Resident Evil 1. Uh, not going to say remastered, because in my opinion, remastered is the same as the original, just better graphics. Remakes are completely new games in my eyes. So that means... Hey, Sean Sullivan. Wait, who would you kiss? Lady Demetrice? From Mari Village? I tried to. She wouldn't have me. Um, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So, the next game in this series is going to be the original Resident Evil 2. We we're playing that even though I played the remake. Because I consider them different games. But I'm not going to be playing the original, original Resident Evil. Because this one just has better graphics. From what I could tell. Did you get a kiss? I tried. She was, she was literally locked away the entire game. And uh... Yeah, it's going to be for me. So if you watch this, thank you for watching. Be sure to down below, leave a subscribe, share, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye.